Russian oligarch billionaire and former owner of Chelsea Football Club, is known not only for his business empire and love for sports, but also for his remarkable art collection. Usually making headlines for his dubious business dealings, it's been reported that his art collection rivals that of most museums. With a net worth estimated in the billions, Abramovich has indulged in the world of art, curating a vast collection. Abramovich's journey into art began in the early 2000s, when he started collecting modern and contemporary art. Over the years, his passion for art grew and he became an avid collector, amassing an extensive and impressive assortment of artwork. Now, what sets Abramovich's art collection apart is its diversity. His collection spans various art forms, including paintings, sculptures, and even full-blown installations. From iconic pieces by renowned artists like Francis Bacon and Lucian Freud, to contemporary works by emerging talents, Abramovich's collection reflects a broad spectrum of artistic styles and movements. One of the standout pieces in Abramovich's collection is Francis Bacon's Triptych 1976, which he acquired in a private sale for a staggering $86 million. This masterpiece showcases Bacon's distinctive style of distorted and emotionally charged portraiture. It's a testament to Abramovich's commitment to securing some of the most coveted artworks in the world. Another significant work in his collection is Lucian Freud's Benefits Supervisor Sleeping, a portrayal of a nude, heavy-set woman that fetched an astounding $33.6 million at auction. Now, this piece is emblematic of Freud's intimate and uncompromising style. While Abramovich's collection boasts iconic pieces from established artists, he also demonstrates a keen eye for emerging talents. His support for young artists has not only helped nurture new talent, but also has contributed to the ever-evolving landscape of contemporary art. Abramovich's art collection is more than just a display of wealth. It's a testament to his commitment to the arts and culture. Even so, many of these pieces now find themselves in limbo due to sanctions imposed due to Abramovich's connections with Putin. Sealed away in secure warehouses, this is a great loss. And while these works were predominantly shown in British galleries as recently as 2021, they have become invisible since Russia attacked Ukraine. The collection is a demonstration to Abramovich's discerning taste, passion for culture and his commitment to the arts. Through the acquisition of iconic pieces and support for emerging artists, he's carved out a unique space in the world of art collecting. His collection not only reflects his immense wealth, but also his dedication to preserving and promoting the beauty and the diversity of the art world for generations to come. Let's hope that one day they can return to public display. Music